Although, you know, you're going to meet um, Dan. Dan Rather from CBS News? Yeah. Oh. How do you know him? He's We follow each other on Etsy. <laughs> Dude, you're like Theo Vaughn today. Uh, no, I'm not. You're like taking things <laughs> no, somewhere else no, that no, don't no. belong together. No we, no, we both create things on Etsy. We trade. Oh, you follow each other on Etsy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do yeah, you yeah. make on Etsy? Mittens. You're no. a mitten guy. Yeah. Bobby mitten mitten. bamboo. So no fingers. <laughs> mittens. No. They're so stiff, though. Yeah. <laughs> You right. just have to pick and up. And so not warm. Yeah. And don't wear them around pandas. <laughs> but uh, What does he make, Dan, rather on, on Etsy? Oh, he makes these. Um, so you know how he loves to talk on the mic? Yeah. He makes it out of, um, you know, um, linen. Good. You got it. Yeah, yeah. Linen swabs. He makes linen microphones? <laughs> yeah. And you know the, the, the tips of the Q-tip? I could, do I? <laughs> yeah. Cotton? That's not really cotton. Is it not? No. What's on the tip of a Q-tip? Q. Oh, it's just a bunch of Q. <laughs> yeah. What do you think the tip? Dude, the tip of it's a Q. So that's a bunch of Q woven up? Yeah, man. Oh, wow. You don't know the difference between Q and cotton, dude? What is it? Well, I don't know. And that's why it's like mysterious. It's like Q, like in Star Trek, Next Generation, there was a character named Q. Mm. And he was like sort of like this character that... He was sort of like God. He came in and out, but no one could really describe what he was. That's a Q-tip. So that's what the Q-tip. So the Q-tip is named after the Q from. Q is a mystery. You know, first of all, <laughs> isn't that a mystery letter? Q. Yeah. yeah. Why? There's not a lot of words with Q in it. No, he's saying why is a mystery letter. I'm saying why is a mystery letter. That's a good another mystery. There's two of them. How many words start with the letter Q? Question. Quail. Co Queen. Quagmire. Quince. Quagmire. Queef. 975 words start with the letter Q. That's not good. Quadruple. Now, now Quaff, how many words start with B? L less. Wow. That can't be right. How many like words cool. start with B? What is, how does it say? It's pretty interesting. In the English, yeah. Yeah, 890. Less words start with B than Q. We learned something. That's different. no way, dude. Pretty impressive. What's, there probably isn't a lot of words that start with what I think that it starts with. Well, how many? Yeah. What do you think? What what letter has the most? What like, if, let me see if we can. I can't even think of twenty words that start with B. Twenty words. What? Yeah, yeah. No, you know it. B. Yeah. Um, I'd have to think though. Let's do it right now. Yeah. Ready? You go one. I go one. You go one. Go. Oh, and whoever stops. Yeah. Okay. Go. Buffoon. Bombastic. Burrito. Bouquet. Below. Beef. Bark. Bussy. B bussy. <laughs> yeah, a bussy. That's a new. That's a new term that's in the dictionary now. Okay. Yeah, it's a it's a male pussy. Really? You don't know about this? We can do urban stuff? Why couldn't we? <laughs> we have an urban audience, don't oh, we? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Uh, balls. Booyah. Black. <laughs> Bounce. Barracuda. <laughs> Barracuda's good. Isn't Barracuda one? Yeah, Barracuda's good. It's a fish, right? It is a fish. Yeah. Uh, beacon. Bamboozle. Banshee. Uh, Bowdry. Bent. Black. I said black. You did? Bruise. Block. Bruise. Block, then. Block. <laughs> What? Are we going this way now? Yeah, go. go. Blah. What? Blah. Blah? Blah. B-L-A-H. Blood. Oh, bl blood? Blot? Blah? What are you saying? Forget it. Blah. <laughs> Forget it. Forget this game, man. We're we, we going forever. We did it. We did it. Do it. We did it. We did more. That time. was at least 898. Now let's see if we can do Q, because Q technically has more. I can't do it. Let's do it. Go. I know three. Go. Queen. You already said it. Quail. Qu quagmire. Question. Quince. Q-tip. Qualify. <laughs> I don't know. Qu I got no one. Queen quandary. <laughs> I have yeah. no idea. Quantify. Quantify. Quality. Question. Oh. Quaint. Quaint. <laughs> Quick. Uh. <laughs> Quack. Qu quell. Ooh. Quit. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. I'm out. Yeah. So we know a guy who met somebody on a set. Yeah. And way above, you know what I mean, his pay grade. She's the most famous person I think we, people. No, anyone knows. Yeah, she's so And, you know, you know, this is when he was single. Yeah, it was a long, long, long time, time ago. And she would live by the, uh, up on the hills. Well, she, multiple houses, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. And he and, and late at night, we would see him walk down the hill, uh -huh. right, with his face just just, just, just a fucking pussified, puss, puss juice, pussified. 
famous celebrity puss juice all over his face, and, his and face? He, had, he, confu he looked confused yeah. and gratified. Happy. Happy. I remember the night we took we took a walk and talk. We smoked a joint in my neighborhood, and he told me about the who it was, and I and I, it did make me think for a second. Are all my friends gonna date famous people? All right. Like it made me go, oh my god! Is I that, also is that a normal thing? You can thing? do that. Yeah, that's like what I mean. You never think you can do that. I thought that, but was... you can do it if they let you. You can. <laughs> <laughs> they, they they never let me. I think you could. Well, I never got like you know. I had dinner with Kate Blanchett once. I never got the vibe. Kate Blanchett went to dinner with you, yeah. on a date or no, on a movie. When I did a movie. Oh, you were shooting a film. Yeah, and at night she was like. Well, let's go take out the whole cast out to dinner. And I was sat next to her at dinner. But you were there with like 20 other people. Yeah, Jamie Lee Curtis, all these people were there. That's not the same thing. <laughs> and I was sitting there, and I, in my mind, I'm like, if she did, I would do it. If she made a move. Yeah, yeah. If Kate Blanchett made a move, what would you? what's your move? Look at I'm, Clay, I'm Kate No, 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 please. Bring me a photo of her so I can play her, please. Just so I can get in character. No, I, I don't, I, I don't want to get in trouble here. And she's British, right? Yeah, yeah. She's the nicest person I ever met. Bobby. Yeah. That's Bobby, dead on. What are you what will you be ordering? Me? Oh, well, you know, I'm sober, so I'll get a Diet Coke. Okay, Diet Coke for the little little one. And I'll well, what would you be having? I'll I'll have a gin and tonic. Oh, that's nice. A good choice. If Do I you was mind drinking... if I drink in front of you? Oh, I don't mind at all. Do you mind if I have a drink while you're licking my toes later? I'm hitting Here? On you, Robert. Here? Under the table, you go. I would do it. You'd go right under the oh, table? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If she said right in front of all those people. You oh, yeah. Go. Well, why would you? You can't say. No. It's, a, you know, improv. Always agree. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you did. Have you done movies with, before you were married, with famous people? When you were single ever? No, I still don't do movies with famous people. Kevin Hart's not famous? No, that, but that's now. That was only a couple years ago. No, I never got a big movie. I never got to do anything with. The only people that I got to work with- that Who's the like, biggest actor you've worked with? In my life? Yeah. Because you just did John Cena. Tom Arnold. That's not even fucking, I've done Tom Arnold. Tom Arnold. I've done Tom Arnold. Uh, who's the biggest I ever worked with? Melissa Leo, when I did, I mean, she's an oh, Oscar, yeah, yeah. She's an Oscar yeah, yeah, winner. Yeah, 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 huge. And she would How not, about you? not hook up with me. Uh, Mark Wahlberg. Whoa! Wait, what? Yeah, because I was um, in the wardrobe department on Transformers Five, and I delivered him his shoe inserts. Whoa! Whoa! Was he nice? How big are they? Really nice. How big are they? They were like, um, not like padding, but just like comfort. Yeah, size. but you were the tenth person to give him one. <laughs> yeah, that's right. They were stacking them up. <laughs> I, didn't want, <laughs> I didn't want to say it because he was like kind of shy about that. Yeah, yeah. He was really nice. He came yeah. out of his like trailer. He that was, Mark Wahlberg, you know, what I mean, hit on you? Would you? Yeah. Yeah. Even now. Well, wait, why do you say even now? Like, no, he's older. I mean, I don't know. Older? He's one of those, like, ageless Hollywood. All right, so if Mark Wahlberg called he's you out of the blue. He's ageless. And he the goes, same hey, age. baby, let me take you on a date. You would go on a date with him? Yeah, I would love to go on a date with Mark And Wahlberg. if he tried to. Why, has he said something? <laughs> <laughs> you would make out and all that stuff with him? Maybe. I mean, I would, like, I mean, he's still a person. I'd want to. Get to I'd know him. Probably. But... What if he but said. But I'd still want to yeah. see what if, what if he was like, yo, I want to take you on a date, but, uh. Just let you know, like, I got to fuck on the first date and it's only anal. What would you say? Oh, oh man. You don't do anal at first date? No. But it's my, okay. it's me, it's me, it's Maki Mark. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I know. You gotta let me do it, baby girl. You gotta let me do it. Yeah. And I gotta fuck on the first date and I gotta get the ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it your ass or my ass? Both. I'll both. <laughs> I mean, I'll fuck you, you, your I, I got a happening post. I'll, post, I'll sign it for you. You never heard of the Ma the Wahlberg way? <laughs> <laughs> okay, do happening. You want free hamburger for my family? <laughs> yeah, and free Wahlburgers. <laughs> and you get free Wahlburgers for life. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. a good deal.